So, it's been, as of tomorrow, February, March, April, May, June, July. Five months since I reported what happened to me at Anomaly in Toronto five years ago. Um, and on the 14th of July, I will be requesting um, removal of my breasts from a breast cancer surgeon because I have nodes and I never wanted them to begin with and this seems like a pretty fucking great excuse so I'm going to show him my entire transition story on my Instagram and on my YouTube and hope for the best because I don't know if my family can come with me I don't know if they're gonna listen to me this time I've asked many times um, and to be honest with you like I don't want children personally I don't want to carry children I would like hysterectomy I have also asked for that many times and trigger warning I have been raped assaulted sexually against my own will um, this is technically a hate crime in my opinion as a survivor as somebody who's transitioning I can't see it as anything else and the fact that the police don't is ridiculous because I'm not transitioned yet um, I was never allowed to transition. I was forced to be a woman um, because that's how you guys liked it. And um, I'm not anymore. So please let me be the person I want to be um, and obtain the surgeries that are covered under my country's government policies. And let me live my life because the mental health care programs you're providing are just making me last. It's not helpful. What do you want me to do? Like, cut off my breasts? Like, that's what people do. You know that, right? Like, I don't want to have children for somebody. I've told you this. I've had three abortions. Take out my fucking uterus, dude. Please. Like, I don't want to have kids. I don't want to have kids genetically. I don't want to have kids through my body. I don't want to pass down mental health issues. I don't want to have to go through this. My job right now is my, myself and I don't understand why every doctor keeps telling me that I'm going to change my mind when I know I'm not. I have felt this way for as long as I could remember and people keep trying to convince me that they don't remember me like that and you weren't in my brain. You don't know what I thought. You don't know what I felt, what I saw, what I knew, what I didn't know. All you know is what I'm able to express to you and as we can tell like trauma brain is not reliable. So if you could just listen to me as the person talking to you right now and not um, whatever the fuck you think I am, that would be great. Um, I would like a mastectomy and I would like a hysterectomy. Thanks, Canada. Bye.